Learning how to power clip in Corel Draw is very easy and allows you to create some great unique results. So I have imported an image here on the right hand side and then I drew a heart on it just using my basic shapes and selecting a heart and I drew it in. I turned the outline red just because it's easier for me to see it on top of that black and white image. So select the um, item that you want to go inside the container, then go to Effects, Power Clip, Place Inside Container, you'll get an arrow, click to where you want it to go, and there you go. Now if I had not um, positioned this properly, you can see what happens. So you want to make sure that you have your container placed exactly where you want it to be for the end result. Now I'll show you something here. If I click the object that I want to go inside the word Susie, and they're not touching at all, nothing really happens. So again, placement is important. Um, I added a red outline uh, to the name. Of course, using a big blocky font will give you better results than a thin font. So I click on the pattern, and then the pattern goes inside uh, the text. So using the power clip, again, you get great results, and it's very easy to use. For more information or to sign up for your free trial, visit laserU.com.